Today, we're jumping right into a question you've probably thought about before. Why do most girls have higher voices than boys? Let's find out on today's episode of... Colossal Question. In order to answer this question, we need to understand how speaking works in the first place. How high or low your voice sounds depends on the size and shape of your vocal cords. Vocal cords are muscles in the back of your throat that stretch like rubber bands across your voice box, called a larynx. Every time you talk, you push air out of your lungs and through your vocal cords. This causes them to vibrate really fast, which makes a sound. Think of it like strings on an instrument. The vibration of a guitar string is what makes sound, and the tighter and smaller you make the string, the higher it sounds. That's why ukuleles are smaller and higher pitched. So, just like guitar strings, the shorter and thinner your vocal cords are, the higher your voice sounds. That's why people have higher voices when they're young and deeper voices when they age. Their vocal cords are getting bigger. As boys get older, their bodies release a hormone called testosterone that helps them grow fast and causes their vocal cords to grow thick and long. Girls also start to produce testosterone, just not nearly as much as boys. So their voices get a little deeper as they age, but usually not as deep as boys. So now that you know how your vocal cords work, try playing with the pitch of your voice. When you talk in a low voice, you're squishing your vocal cords down to make them thicker. And when you talk in a high voice, you're stretching them out like a rubber band to make them nice and thin. Pretty cool, huh? And now you know... <coughs> and now you know why most girls have higher voices than boys. Comment below if you have a question you'd like to know the answer to. And don't forget to subscribe for more episodes of... Colossal Questions! Only on DreamWorks TV.